The Vermont Army National Guard is in the process of packing up rail cars. Yeah, they're doing this ahead of a special training exercise. NBC 5's Jackie Pascal joins us live from the Burlington Rail Yard right now. And Jackie, what can you tell us about this process? So David Alice, that training is they're calling it the Super Bowl of trainings. That's going to be in Louisiana. So they have to pack up a lot of equipment to get there. Uh, so I'm here with someone who knows a lot about the logistics of all of this. We're seeing some cars moving around right now. Talk to me about what it's going to take to get there. Sure. The soldiers have done an amazing job. Uh, we're on our last day of loading, so we're a full day ahead of schedule. Uh, today we're going to load about 100 vehicles and that'll complete our mission today of getting over 650 pieces down to Fort Polk for that for that operation. And talk to me, what time do they have to get here in the morning for this? You know, what exactly are they in charge of doing for this movement? Yeah, we start pretty early at 03. Uh, we're doing convoys not to disturb traffic here in Burlington. Uh, so from about 03 to about nine o'clock at night, these soldiers are full speed getting these vehicles down here and loaded. And uh, they've been doing an amazing job. And then once everything is loaded, they're going to this training. Talk to me about what's gonna happen when you get to Louisiana. Yeah, it's the ultimate training experience. Every single job will get uh, taxed to their max. Uh, they'll really have to apply, you know, their specific job assets uh, in a combat scenario. And uh, Vermonters have always done well. They've always succeeded, uh, not only here at the rail yard, but they'll succeed down at JRTC. And uh, Vermonters should be very proud of that. You know, we have young soldiers here who are giving their time to uh, defend our freedom and uh, very proud to be a part of it. And they're going to be with people from all around the country, right? You said around 5,000 soldiers total yeah, there? Absolutely. We have 18 states and territories participating, over 5,000 soldiers, about 3,000 vehicles. So it's a very large scale operation. And a lot of that is coming from right over here. You're seeing that right now on camera, the movement of all these trucks loading onto these rail cars. Again, they're saying this is the last day that they'll be doing that, but luckily they're getting it done right now and we're a little bit off the road. So hopefully it's not causing any traffic for you. But again, that uh, when do you leave for the training? Uh, so the train will leave here in the next few days, but a majority of the Vermonters will go down at the end of April okay. and we'll be there till about the uh, first part of June. All right, so that's when that training is. So uh, that's there's a lot of process that still has to happen today and a lot of hard work that is going on. We're live in Burlington this morning, Jackie Pascal, NBC5 News.